uh, late afternoon, uh, almost supper, almost New Year's, freaky friends. Well, I decided I wanted to get one last hunt in before New Year's. Uh, I was gonna go out tonight and go out on the beaches, but they're not quite low enough for my liking, so I'm not gonna go. So I decided I was just gonna go for a couple hours uh, today before it got too dark. And do you see me holding something up? Do you see it? Yes. Um, what's cool about this, well, it's, uh, as you might recognize, it's not one I find lots of. <coughs> Excuse me. It's called Elcornensis. And uh, it's a fairly rare ammonite to find this, this complete here uh, on the puntledge. Uh, but what's cool about it too, it's, you know, I, in my pocket's full. Uh, on, see on the back here, on there, there was another ammonite on top of there that was uh, Heriserus. But uh, it broke into about 10 pieces. So I'm gonna see how much of that I can glue back together. And if all the pieces fit, I'll glue it onto here and it'll make it look that much cooler. This ain't complete. It's missing a good chunk of it. But it's still, like I say, for that, for that uh, type, it's pretty cool. I thought it was a Nautilus at first. I was hoping it was going to be another freaky Nautilus, but um, I'm happy with this uh, Ocornensis, and it should have a nice center. Uh, I just got a little bit right there to take off in the middle, and it should look really cool inside. And uh, one thing I've noticed about these Ocornensis too sometimes is this one. It does look like it was broke. Uh, and there's puncture marks. So uh, that could have been the reason it died. Is some big freaky critter was swimming in the river. Ah, not me. No, probably an elasmosaur or a mosasaur. I wasn't around back then. I know I look old, but I'm not quite that old. But uh, thanks for um, supporting me throughout the years, freaky friends. And uh, I love you all. And uh, this is, like I said, it's 2015 right now. I'm so far behind on posting. I'm getting caught up a little bit. I'm only like over a year behind, so that's not bad. I was two years behind for the longest time. But, uh, oh, see that, freaky friends? There's uh, icicles hanging down and falling all the time, and uh, that's why uh, it's sometimes good to go out because all the stuff's falling down at your feet. But you have to be very careful because uh, I hadn't been here for a while. And Oh, there's more stuff falling and since last time I came this wasn't down Huge tree roots trees that wasn't down last time I came so that just shows how fast the the rivers and everything are changing over and over and over again and But this old Cornensis woohoo, and I'll show you where I got it from. I dug it out of there And like I said, I was just going for, uh, I found the Heriserus, but it, it turned out it wasn't even much of one. And then right beside it, this guy popped out. So sometimes you know it's not complete, but you gotta keep going because you never know what's behind it or what's connected onto it. Okay, freaky friends, rock on. Love you all. Hey, oh, I'm still filming. I thought I was gonna take a picture. I thought I clicked off. Well, I never clicked off. Just look at Freaky Friends. <laughs>